After dropping their first conference game on Friday to Cal, Arizona State looked to upset Stanford and Tempe. On paper, it looked like an uphill battle against the former national champions in 97 degree weather. However, the Devils found the back of the net early when the pass was intercepted by Olivia Wynn. Wynn turned on the Jets with Jasmine Wilkinson and handed Wilkinson a one-on-one -on -one opportunity with the goalie before blasting it in the goal for an early 1-0 lead. Stanford looked to answer shortly after when midfielder Amy Sire marched into the Devils' half. After sliding past a defender, she struck the ball and forced Casca Pear to make the diving save to hold the shutout. Captain Kiki Pickett also tried to penetrate the Devils' defense with a lob into the box. However, her pass was just out of the reach of her teammates, leading to a Sun Devils goal kick. Issues Eva Van Dersen wide in the gap with a free kick into the box to Douglas. Douglas tried to fire it before it got deflected 30 yards out. And Van Dersen found it and rifled a screamer over the goalie for a spectacular goal. Coach Graham Winkworth then discussed how that goal deflated the Cardinal squad. I think it was huge. I think it deflates the team when you concede a goal like that um, that early. And then for us to score a second one relatively quick afterwards, I mean, what goals, by the way? Special goals. Um, so to, for us to score two and then what, the, the key for me at halftime was making sure we, we were still on the front foot. We didn't want to, even though we allow um, teams like Stanford to have the, a lot of the possession, we didn't want them to have possession deep in our half. With one minute left in the game, Stanford tried to break the clean sheet. Yet, the corner kick failed off of a foul, and the Devils walked out with a 2-0 win. The Devils now will return on April 9th up in Utah to take on the Utes.